Obviously, home advantage means a lot. Uh, we went to Broomfield and we got the draw, and I think that uh, maybe was the hardest test. So hopefully, we'll, we can get at them tonight and maybe get a result. Moment last night's cup replay at Kilbawi swung away from Airdrie. A flare-up after this challenge between Evan Balfour and Scott Murdoch led to Airdrie's Balfour being sent off. A minute from half-time, Airdrie keeper John Martin failed to hold Kenny Wilson's corner and Ken Eady was first to the loose ball to fire the Bankies in front. And they ended the second half the way they'd finished the first, this time Jimmy Sanderson at fault and veteran striker Eady showing skill and composure to score his second goal, the one which sealed Clyde Banks' passage into the fourth round. More drama on the final whistle as Banky's Murdoch was red carded for non complimentary comments to the referee. But at least two goal Ken Eady was happy. Yeah, ecstatic. Um, a couple nights are back here, I think. Uh, that's probably the best night since um, the run in the cup we had in 1989. Then they got to a Hamden semi final and lost to Celtic. This time East Stirling or Cove Rangers stand between Clyde Bank and the quarter finals. If we can hold on to the young players here, I mean, it's going to be very difficult. There's a board of scouts here tonight watching. Um, a few players in particular, John Henry, Craig Flanagan. Um, and, you know, it's not the club's policy to hold on to them. So I think if we can hold on to them, you know, at least through the cup, um, we've, got, we've got a chance.